A major win for New York waterways. We first told you about the Billion Oyster Project a couple of weeks ago. Now it's getting nearly $1 million in funding. As John Diaz explains, it's enough to restore a major oyster reef that has gone practically extinct in Brooklyn. I think we really deserve it. We've put a lot into this. The Commodore, the Paradigate Yacht Club, New York City's only black owned yacht club in Canarsie, Brooklyn, is eager to see their efforts get matched since the nonprofit Billion Oyster Project will be enhancing the surrounding waters. It's going to bring clean water, uh, different fish, species of fish coming in, and possibly in the future, you may be able to even swim in Jamaica Bay. Wednesday, a special check presentation by U.S. Congressman Hakeem Jeffries ensured it. Minority Leader Jeffries represents the Brooklyn District, which is surrounded by three bodies of water. He calls the oyster mission meaningful. Extreme weather events like Superstorm Sandy have hit communities like Canarsie hard. We've seen our shoreline, our coastline, uh, our resilience decline. The Billion Oyster Project will use the federal funds to build an almost seven acre, 90 million oyster reef in Jamaica Bay, where experts say oyster reefs have gone practically extinct. It highlights how hard the work is and how expensive it is to get all these oysters in the water. The funds will also be used to expand STEM education opportunities at New York City public schools, teaching more kids how to advocate for the environment and marine life. It gives us even more of a opportunity to like practice our work and how to improve our skills in practicing marine work. The Billion Oyster Project is hoping to start building this new reef by next summer. From Canarsie, Brooklyn, John Diaz, CBS News, New York. And experts say the project is already showing significant progress. More wildlife and marine life spotted all over the city in recent years.